The NBA playoffs are here, and what better way to celebrate than playing a game where we have to guess various NBA teams going off of just their NBA 2K player ratings. This is Rating Rundown. I'm Daniel. I'm Dalton. And Mike, tell us the rules. All right, y'all, the rules are simple. I'll give you guys the NBA 2K23 rating of these starting five players on the team. Your job is to work together to try and guess the team's name as well as the team's overall rating. Each of those will be worth one point each. When you get stumped, you'll have three lifelines that can only be used once when you decide to use them. The lifelines are how many all-stars this team have in 2023, has the team won a championship in the last 10 years, and whether they are in the Western or Eastern Conference. All right, team one, you've got the starting one, two, three, four, five from left to right. All right, right away, we know that the point guard is the best player. Their forwards are weak. Okay, let me, and just so it's clear, the guy on the left, it, it goes from point guard to shooting guard, center. to small forward. Yep. Center's the 80, right? Yes, correct. Okay. I feel like this could be the Warriors. No, no they, Curry, did not, they did not put Steph at 89. Yeah, Curry wouldn't be 89. That's right. I could see this being like the Hawks, Trey Young was, and Dejounte Murray. Yeah, that's gonna that was gonna be my next guess. You think Trey Young's at 89 though already? Yes, yeah. I, I, I think he deserves to be higher than 89. Okay, let's try to think who's on the team. So Trey Young, 89. Yeah, Dejounte Murray at 84. I don't know who their forwards are. Who's their center? Is Clint Capella still the center? Yeah, I think it's Capella, right? I feel like the centers are going to be low for every team except for the Nuggets, the Sixers, and the Timberwolves. Yeah. I'm, I I say that we go Hawks here. I, I think that's my guess. Okay. Um, I I mean, I think it's too high to be another guard-heavy team like uh, the Hornets. True. Like Lamelo being at 89. There's no way Lamelo is 89 already. I'd, that'd be pretty crazy. Yeah, let's go Atlanta. But what do you think for the overall rating? I think that they're rated at a 82. Because all their players are above 80. So I don't think they're, I'm, but they may have, a, they kind of have a weak bench. I'm going to go, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick at 82. Low, low 80s. Okay, let's do it. We're locked in. Hawks and 82. Yeah, both of them. No way, really? Yes. Really? Yes. The exact number two? Yes. Holy no shit. No way. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's wild. No lifelines used at all. Like just a clean, clean win there. All right, here we go. Second team. Here we go. Oof. Oh, this is a, oh, this is tough. This is gonna this be hard. This is a bad There's team. There's so many teams like this. <laughs> I don't know. Like, oh man. Yeah, but they're th this team is worse than Atlanta. This is not a playoff team. This could be the Knicks. Could this be the the Nets? This could be the Nets. Who do the Nets have? The Nets have, um, I don't know why I'm blanking on names right now. The two guys from Phoenix, which, yeah, which, my boys. But that, I feel like that's kind of low for them, though. I'm trying to think of other teams that are pretty mid. Best player on the team is the point guard. This could also be the Hornets. Yeah. But is are their forwards really that good? Could this be something like the Pistons, where they're giving Jaden Ivey already a really high rating? I don't know. But I think, I don't, I don't think that they rate him at 83. Do we want to use a lifeline here? Yeah, I think we use a lifeline. But which one do you think will be most useful? We know there's no all-stars because the ratings are so low. So we're not going to use that. Okay. Um, Western or Eastern Conference could help a little bit. I feel like the championship would be the best one if they won a championship in the last 10 years. Yeah, but that doesn't get like that doesn't narrow any of our teams down between the Hornets, well, Nets, true. Knicks. So I guess we go with Western East. Let's use the Western Eastern Conference lifeline, Quincy. Okay. This is a Western Conference team. The Knicks, the Hornets, and the Nets are all in the Eastern Conference. That's what I thought. This could be Houston. You think they're rated that high, though? Okay, think about the conference. This isn't the Spurs, because I feel like those numbers would be way lower. The only other one that I could think is the Pistons, but I don't think that they gave Jaden Ivey an 83. But the Houston Rockets center is supposed to be really good, though, right? That sanguine or whatever yeah sanguine so is I don't good think he i don't would, think he's the weakest on the team yeah i don't think he would be 78 that's the only thing there okay unless who else is, unless 2k who, who's it. a bottom feeder in the in the in the west I'm trying to think so houston spurs i'm trying to think of just all the worst teams this has to be a bad team. 
It could be right. It could be Houston, but Sanguine has thrown me off here. I'm going to go with, I'm going to lock in Rockets. I think that's just because we don't have any stars in here. You know what I mean? Yeah, because we can't, don't have anybody. It can't be OKC because SGA has got to be in the 90s by now, right? Like, correct, correct. I think you're right. I think it's Rockets, and I would say, what do you think, 78 maybe for the overall? I, I was going to go 77, but I'm down to go 78 if that's what you feel comfortable with. Let's go 78. Rockets and 78. Okay. That's our answer, Quincy. This was the mm. San Antonio Spurs at 79. Damn, it was the Spurs. Damn. So we were in the right state, and we were one number off. <laughs> yeah, we were close. All right, we're ready for the next one. Oh, this this has two stars. This is Dallas. Oh, this could all, wait. Yeah. This could also be. No, no, 95 sounds right for Luca. 90 sounds right for Irving because of the amount of time he's missed. Uh, Do you think that they they gave uh, Clay a 90? But no, I don't see him giving it. This is 100% the Mavs. Yeah, this has to be the Mavs. I, again, the only one I could think is is Golden State because of the point guard heavy and a good two guard. But again, there's no way they, they ranked Andrew Wiggins and um, yeah. Draymond Green and the on, same as... And honestly, I'll be very shocked if Steph is under like a 97. I feel like Steph would be like a 98. I bet you he's 96, 97. I bet you he's yeah. right there. Um, in terms of overall rating, I bet you the Mavs were rated pretty high. I bet you they gave him like an 88. Ugh, I don't know if they would give him that. 87? I would say 85. It's me at 86. All right. All right, Mike. Da getting... Dallas Mavericks, 86. Wrong, mm. wrong, baby. They're both wrong? Yeah. <laughs> what? Who is it? It's the Boston Celtics at 84. Oh, shit. <laughs> Shit. I didn't also, think the of the Celtics are only in 84. What? How are the that, Celtics that only 84? Low. They're like the best team in the East. Also, yeah, I could see this now. Jason Tatum being a 90. Wait, wait, they had Tatum playing the one? No, Jason Tatum's at 95. Jalen yeah, Brown's at saying. 90. Yeah, I thought Tatum played more of a forward role. That's what I thought. Mike, I don't think you put them in the right order. I'm not gonna lie. Because each one has been the the best player has been on the far left. <laughs> now that, that's completely thrown us off. Yeah, because like that's why I didn't think of Boston because I always pictured him as a small forward. Tatum. Yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Okay, so it is in the wrong order. Oh, so this is just best to worst. This is just the best player to the worst player. Oh, this holy is, shit! This got a whole this lot is harder. Ten times harder, dude. <laughs> I can't believe we got the first one then, bro. Know, well, we got crazy. so lucky. I'll just tell you the first player's position. Okay. Okay, the first player's position on this team is a point guard. Okay. 92. Guard heavy. Pretty... Uh, not a bad team. Whoever the second player is not bad. Who's a 92 point guard out there? Because we already got Trey. Yeah. There's no way Steph is that low. No. I'm trying to think of all the point guards now. Luka's not going to be 92. Is Luka, isn't Luka a small forward? No, Luca plays point guard. I know he Same plays it, but I thought it like his actual. Okay, you don't think they got Lamelo rated that high, right? There's no way. I hope not. Also, the rest of the Hornets are not this good. Yeah, that's true. This is a this is a low key. This might be the Knicks. Jalen Brunson at a 92. Oh, Jalen Brunson. That makes sense. Brunson could be at a 92 now. And then you got Randall at an 87. R.J. Barrett at 85. 85 is high for RJ Barrett, though, let's be honest. From the last two games, we got two lifelines. I would use the championship question here. Okay. Uh, Mike, has this team won a championship in the last 10 years? No. Okay. I I'm buying the Knicks now. Yeah, I'm 100% on the Knicks. So I'd say maybe Knicks, and I'd say 85? Uh, I'm going to go with an 84. If the, if the Celtics are an 86, then we got to think. I might even go 83. Because you got an 82 and an 80 on your team. What was the first one we got? The Hawks. And they were 82. Correct. So I'm going to go 83 here. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Knicks at 83, Mike. Got the rating correct at 83. Ooh, okay. okay. Well, we got one point. But the shooters will shoot. 
It's the Memf Memphis Grizzlies with John ja Morant. <sighs> uh, <laughs> that's low for Jaw. That is low for Jaw. Yeah, I would have thought Jaw was at 95. Also, Memphis is only an 83 as the two seed in the West. Okay. It is a SG point guard. Yeah, isn't Brunson a shooting guard? He was when he played for Dallas. Because if Luca was point, then he yeah. was shooting guard. Yeah. Do we? I don't know if the Knicks are this good though. That one more. That's high. Nice yeah. How many All Stars were on this team? This team had one All Star. That sounds like the Knicks. Julius Randle was an All Star. Oh yeah, Randle was an All Star this year. That's right. Was Brunson an All Star? I don't think so. And we're so, this is All Star this year, right? Like this last All Star game. Twenty twenty three. But also, why would I mean? I guess I didn't understand that, anyways. But why did your best player not make the All Star team, but your second best player did? Also, who's who's their three? Like, wait, their second yeah, but, best player made the All Star game, not the ninety two. No, because no, Jalen Brunson, I don't think made the All Star team, but Julius Randle did. Really? Yes. So this could be the Knicks. What do you mean? I mean that would mean that it's not the Knicks. But it, I mean, what are some of the other teams that are low-key playoff teams? Or that that made the playoffs, you know? Because you said Brunson wasn't in the All-Star game. Randall, right. Randall was. Know, that, mean, yeah, but that means that... Randall would be the 87. I could see Randall being an 87. Yeah, but is R.J. Barrett 86 or 84? I highly doubt that. R.J. Barrett's probably the 77 here. But I don't know of two other players that are almost as good as Julius Randall on the Knicks. Okay. I don't even. I don't know much about the next roster. Let's so let's think shooting guards in the All Star game. The Kings, Darren Fox. Darren Fox, I thought plays forward. I thought he was a shooting guard. Did Darren Fox break the All Star team? I'm trying to think. I'm pretty sure he was. Could this be the Cavs? Yeah, Donovan Mitchell. I can see him at 92. And then because they have uh, Darius Garland, he swings from one and two. And that team is stacked. And Donovan Mitchell made the all-star team, but I don't think anyone else did. I'm, I'm gonna say Cavs. Yeah, let's go Cavs at... I'm gonna go an 84. Hmm, no, because Bo Boston is the 84 and they're the best team. 82, 83, 82. 82. All right, what? Mike, we're locking in. We're going with Cavs at 82. Ding, 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 ding. Woo Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Did we get them both right? This is the Cleveland Cavaliers at an 82 overall. Damn. Damn. Let's go. Let's go. If you guys want to see more games like this, let us know in the comments down below. And do remember to like and subscribe for more. Is that the outro?